What's going on everyone, Bass here. So with Aaron Rodgers uh, back with the Green Bay Packers for the foreseeable future, the Packers have decided to use their franchise tag on the deadline, which is today on Devontae Adams. Ian Rappaport put out this tweet here saying, thanks to the new cap room, the Packers are expected to franchise tag wide receiver Devontae Adams. And I don't think this is a surprise to any of us whether or not the Packers were going to keep Devontae Adams and Aaron Rodgers or not. We all kind of expected at least a franchise tag today. Therefore, they could either A, trade him or B, extend him to um, a long-term extension. And now it's more likely that B happens. They extend him to a long-term extension. Now, what that extension may be, we will see. If Aaron, if uh, excuse me, if Devonta Adams plays hardball with that thirty million dollar number, the Packers may just say, "Hey, well, we're going to keep you on this franchise tag." And then you know you go down that slippery slope of a player potentially holding out like Devonta Adams. But I wouldn't see that happening. Um, although we don't think Devonta Adams likes this, the franchise tag or would like to play under the franchise tag. Now that Aaron Rodgers is coming back and they're going all in again to try to get another ring. I just don't see Devontae Adams sitting out even if it is under a franchise tag. Now, obviously we all want him to get the money he deserves, the extension he deserves, but we will see how that goes down. But at the end of the day, the Packers still have to clear a lot of salary cap um, room before March 16th. Who knows what the exact number is right now? Because we don't really know the number on the Aaron Rodgers deal, what it lowers his salary cap in 2022 to be. Um, Devonta Adams' franchise tag is an instant, you know, $19 million on that on that salary cap. So um, getting an extension with him could likely lower that 2022 number um, down. So the Packers could then try to, you know, further their way to clear and get under the salary cap by March 16th. There's a lot more moves to be done, and obviously I'll be updating you. You guys as they come along on this channel so just be on the lookout but on that note that's all i have for you guys today leave your thoughts down in the comments below I'll catch you on the next one as always go pack go